Invoices are important part of any business. Mostly companies use it to track sales, manage cash flow, and improve customer satisfaction. In this video, we generate automatic invoice in Excel by using formulas and macro. Automatic Excel invoice mostly used in businesses to save time, improve accuracy, customer satisfaction, and compile with regulations because customer will be able to understand what they are being charged for and when they are due to pay. Let's start this video and generate automatic Excel invoice. Mostly beginners Excel users are confused how to create automatic Excel invoice. First confusion is how to create Excel invoice format and second confusion is how to create different invoices for different customers and third one is if create excel invoice how to use it multiple times so friends do not worry about we can solve all these problems complete watch this video because if you are excel user this video helps you a lot you can see blank excel sheet for invoice format first we know this excel page dimensions if you click page layout here in bottom of this sheet excel sheet divides into pages now click on again normal layout now you can see this dotted lines this will help you to create invoice format now we know our excel page area let's start to create invoice format First we enter bill headings, serial number, description, rate, quantity and amount. Adjust all columns like this according to page dimensions. In top row enter your business name and in second and third row enter address like this. Select all three rows and go to merge option and click on merge across each row separately merge now design this according to your mind fill background color you can also change text color like this now select this row and click on merge and center right here in voice and slightly increase the size leave one row select this invoice area and adjust size 14 in this cell enter bill number and in this enter date select these cells and merge this now enter name contact and address of customer now head of invoice format is ready you can check print view by pressing Ctrl plus P. Looking good. Now move forward. Select these cells and click on merge across. Now select this cell right here. Total amount. In this cell write GST. Assume it 8%. And in this cell write grand total. Now select these cells and merge center and write here authorize signatory select these cells and merge center and enter here dash line by pressing plus minus sign button like this adjust size now check print view control plus p this look amazing now basic invoice format is ready now our first confusion is solved. Move to the second confusion and that is how to automate this Excel invoice. Our product namely is come in front automatically. Rate of this product automatically appear and also amount of product calculate automatically with all tax included. First select this cell and click on data tab. Go to data validation and click on data validation. Now in data validation dialog box click this drop down arrow and select list and click inside source box. Now click on this arrow go to sheet 2 and select all products and press enter. Now press ok. Now you can see all product 
list appear. We want all product lists also here in description. For this, click on this cell and move mouse pointer. And when this black plus appear, just left mouse click, hold and drag down like this. Now you can see product list apply on every row. When we select any product, rate appear in under rate column. For this, we apply VLOOKUP formula. Right here is equal to VLOOKUP bracket start for VLOOKUP value select this cell comma for table array click on sheet 2 select all that record comma for column index number we enter 2 because all product rates available in column 2 comma click on exact match and press enter if we select any product rate of this product automatically appear to apply formula in all row just go to this cell corner click and drag like this you can see not applicable error this is because our description list is empty to remove this error we use if error formula click on this cell press f2 now update this formula right here if error go to at the end comma now enter here double inverted comma back it close and press enter now apply this formula to all you can see not applicable error removed now we select some products you can see rate of this product appear automatically. If we want internal hard disk and quantity of this internal hard disk is 2. Enter 2 here under quantity heading. For amount calculation we use simple formula. Right here is equal to select this cell multiply by this cell simple and press enter. You can see amount calculated automatically. If we increase quantity, you can see formula work perfectly. Apply this formula to all these cells just like this. You can see value error. Again, we use if error formula here. Apply to all cells. Now for total amount calculation, select this cell, press and hold Alt and also equal button on keyboard press enter total amount calculate automatically for general cell tax calculation select this cell is equal to select total amount multiply with 8 percent for grand total select this cell total amount plus gst press enter if you add more product just select product and enter quantity all calculation automatically done. Now see print view looking perfect. You can print out this invoice and give to the customer. You can also save this invoice as soft copy in PDF form like this. Now we move forward if we need to create new invoice for another customer. The activity we perform first delete existing customer record one by one. That is very difficult thing to do. Here we need shortcut term. For this we need to go developer tab. Here you can see record macro button. Click on this record macro. A dialog box open. First we give a name to this macro. Clear record. 
like this. Now create shortcut key to perform this macro. Only use that shortcut key which is unique. I am using Ctrl plus Shift plus K. Now press OK. Macro recording start. Be careful here because every step is record. Select record one by one and delete this record like this. After delete record, stop macro. Now we create new invoice here like this. You can see a customer invoice created automatically. All calculation done automatically. Now we want to clear this report. Just simple press Ctrl plus Shift plus K. You can see all record clear automatically and fresh invoice format is here to enter new invoice. I hope you will understand this automatic Excel invoice. Create format, add automatic part by using formulas and macro, add automatic part by using formulas and how automatically clear record with shortcut. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will see you in the next video where we learn that how automatically Excel invoice connected with database. Thanks for watching.